The first of a dozen new basketball courts going up in Dallas today. It is a project funded by Basketball Hall of Famer Nancy Lieberman's charity. Robbie Owens tells us this is an effort to build bridges with basketball after the Dallas police ambush. In a neighborhood marked by stray dogs and entrenched poverty. I'm every one of these kids. Basketball superstar Nancy Lieberman still feels at home. I'm a poor kid from a one parent family, no heat, no electricity, no father, one grandparent away from food stamps. And basketball changed my life. Her talent has taken her around the world, but Dallas is home. So she says the ambush murders of five officers left her weeping as well. When then police chief Brown asked for her charity's help, a dozen new outdoor basketball courts was her response, allowing police to gift them to the community. I don't know if you recall, we had a near riot here, Dixon Circle. This is where we are. Former police chief Brown says the new courts will strengthen bridges in once anxious communities. It's important that we're starting here because this sets the tone for what can happen, not just in Dallas, but all over the country. They're making a connection for sure with all the young people. The friends say they'll take advantage of the rec center gym until the weather warms. It's going to be a great asset, but when it's, you know, the summertime, because right now, you know, it's pretty cold. Until then, they'll just drink. Culturally, I know that there's differences. I know that there's racism. But by God, I have a chance to do something right. Now that, too, is nothing but net. In Dallas, Robbie Owens, CBS 11 News. That just proves she's rock star status, right? In addition to covering costs for the new courts, Lieberman also plans to host basketball clinics at the Dream Courts and use police officers to help coach the players.